I left England because it was raining. Here we hold this. Hey, hey, hey. And I come home to Idaho and it's raining. What is up with the rain? I guess God thinks that we need some moisture. Gotcha. In our lives. <laughs> we might want to sound phone. It was nice. We hold that, baby. So I can drive. Oh, fingers <laughs> over the camera. Yeah. Guess what tomorrow is for Cooper, everybody? Graduation yes, day. Yeah. Graduation day for first. First grade? Do you yep. feel like you're getting so old? You know what I comes guess. after first grade? What? Fifth second. Fifth grade. Second. Fifth grade. Second. Fifth grade. Second. Fifth grade. Second. You're so smart, you're skipping to fifth grade. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, so many people wish you would have been in England. They all asked about you. We were sad Cooper wasn't there. Huh. Why wasn't I there? You were in school. I yeah. said there. There. Okay, you guys, we're going to go get some awesome breakfast food. We're going to show you. What? Breakfast? Isn't it dinner? It's like 2.30 at night. And then we're going to go to a movie. Because <gasps> Grandma will be That's there. That's perfect, too. So come along with us for our adventures of Mommy, Carly, and Cooper. Yeah. It's pitch perfect too. What is it called? We might see that. I have to look up the reviews. I hope it's not too inappropriate. Cooper saw the first one, Honest Parent Confession Moment. And you thought it was pretty funny, right? Yeah. Okay, love you. Bye-bye. You guys are ever in Pocatello, you have to come and eat here. It's the best. Where's your raincoat? Oh, you're so handsome. This thing here called the German pancake, and it comes with powdered sugar, butter, and lemon. And, and a cute boy. And a cute boy. And it is the kitties. Titties, Kitty's titties. <laughs> and listen, do you know what titties are used for? Breastfeeding, giving milk. So don't get perverted on me, okay? Just what you need on a cold, rainy day. Some hot, hot chocolate, chocolate with some sprinkles. Oh, that's kind of hot. No, that one's yours. Hot has hot chocolate, you know? How cool is that? Look at those blue eyes, you guys. Look at those eyes. Look at mom. No, not the creeper eye. I want the hey, blue eyes. Hey, how'd you go that? <laughs> I've watched you called? play Minecraft long enough. You guys like the new color of gels? I don't know the name or the What's or the, the it's just the number. This is Piggy. Cooper said he has a butt back, and I said, "What? Does that mean your back so fat you got a butt?" No, <laughs> no, it's a butt. It covers its butt. Perverted. <laughs> oh, go seriously, go. That's up. funny. Zip, zip that bum, huh? Anyways, we're on a hot chocolate date, and it's real fun, huh? I miss yes. this. I miss this little. Do we look so much alike? Do you think we look yeah. a lot alike? Guess Long hair, blue eyed babies. Guess what this, these two are oh, called? These are from our good friend from, I want to say Manchester. Danny gave them to Cooper and we love him. Thank you. Is it, it's Daniel. I, I don't know if, what if you guys go called? by Danny or Daniel. But we what are these you. called? Leave them in the comments. Leave them in the comments below. Cooper wants you guys to leave them in the comments below if you guys know what those are. No, the names. Oh, the names of them? Oh, that's the back. <laughs> It's so rainy, but oh, I'm grateful because I think we need the moisture, huh? Yes, I guess. Yes, I guess. All right, our food's coming. Let's grab. I definitely is. Thank you. Starting tomorrow. Look at this German pancake. I know it doesn't look like much, but it's amazing. What'd you get? Let's show them. <gasps> Hamburgers and fries. Like it. Get on that protein. Seriously, I know this is weird, you guys, but this German pancake so good. And the lemon, the butter, right? and the powdered sugar. Yeah, that's okay. That's a little burn. And bacon and eggs. Oh gosh, here we go. Let's dive in. Huh? We just saw Pitch Perfect, and it is the funniest ever. It's definitely better than the first. Want to see Jurassic World. You want to see Jurassic Park or Jurassic World? Jurassic World. So I definitely think it's better than the first. I definitely laughed out loud on more than one occasion. Um, we're at Walmart right now trying well, to get some cute I can't stuff put together. Tell you, you gotta see Pitch Perfect. It's funny, huh? Um, there was one part that was super good. Super good. Yeah, there was a part that I was like, uh, oh, plug yours. Why is my chin red? Um, anyways, we're getting some cute stuff for Cooper to put together for his teachers. Oh, you gotta get a big bag of chips. Um, as a thank you, so I'm gonna show you guys. Hopefully, it's not too late. You guys, can for your teachers, look. Do you have any ideas what these all could be? Oh, that's medicine. Cooper's not feeling good. It's a little sneak peek. Oh, we're uh, that's not <laughs> running to that little one. Can we need to get you some what chips is it? and Hot some carrots? Guys, look at all the things we are crafting and making right now. High five. <laughs> Hi. Okay, so we are making some end of the year gifts for Cooper's teachers, and he's writing them. This and is you know, I know. 
That is Cooper's hand. So we'll show you the final product, of course, but for one idea, I'm gonna give you guys three ideas. For one idea, you guys can get a soap, which is super inexpensive, and then some cute string or ribbon. I got this orange, and the colors on this right now is weird. This is like a mango, pink orange, um, or a polka dot. Just find some simple string or ribbon. Even wrapping paper string would work. And then we did Trace Cooper's hand on this crafting paper, crate paper. And we're gonna put it on these soaps with a um, tight to the soap and we're gonna write hands down you are the best teacher or staff ever and then we're gonna give them these little sparkly bags they're super inexpensive it was like three dollars for this whole pack and there's quite six pieces in here um, put a chocolate or a couple chocolate chocolates in there put it all around together and tie it and write hands down you are the best teacher or student staff whatever um, thanks for helping me out so there's one idea um, the next one are these Darling Cups. These are super popular right now. They're everywhere to be found. And we are going to be filling them with Sharpies, these Sharpie markers, just kind of lining the cup with the Sharpie markers inside and then putting some chocolate, some ribbon around it, and a cute card like this saying, thank you for making my brain so sharp this year. You are the best teacher ever. Holla. Um, we also got, look at how cute this one is. It has um, lemons and this is freshly squeezed. I thought even thought it'd be cute to put some fake lemons on this one or something. Anyways, that's a Sharpie idea for the mugs, also inexpensive. And then the last one, I'm pretty excited about this one. How cute is this? A jar full of the alphabet and Cooper is going to write her a A, B, C, A through Z. Every letter he's going to come up with something nice on the letter. And what? then we're going to put the flowers. Every single letter. <laughs> Curveball. You didn't know that one. <laughs> Um, and then we're going to put the flowers, those fresh flowers in some water in here tomorrow morning with the magnet letters. So that will be cute, right? Oh, and then Cooper got her some jewelry. Do you want to show them the jewelry you got her? He picked it out all by himself, his teacher. This darling bracelet, it's pink, by the right? Way, this isn't so cute, huh? The dinosaur's not for her. Oh. And then this necklace. Cooper picked that all up all by himself. So, and I just bought striped paper because I just, who needs striped paper? Ew, ew. <laughs> Anyways, we're crafting the night away. Did you guys enjoy yesterday's vlog about London? Um, there's a good por portion of, of the video clip in yeah. there. Stop. Yeah. <laughs> that is from the boot camp, the Fitness Styles boot camp. Um, comment below if you guys would love to see me at your state hosting a boot camp, kicking your butt. And if you guys were at the boot camp, also comment below and tell everybody how hard or easy, whatever your comments or feedback is. I would love that. And yeah, today's footage is just gonna be of Cooper and I hanging out. We went and saw Pitch Perfect, it's so funny. And tomorrow's, you know, there's a one inappropriate part when- Super. Super. Um, to, I've probably said this a million times, but I feel like a zombie because I just got off my flight from London, England, Birmingham. Oh my God. And, Tomorrow is Cooper's last day of first grade, so we're gonna have some footage graduation of his graduation. Day. What? Are you excited? Graduation day. <gasps> oh, I love him. Okay, here we go, let's craft away. You guys, I'm not trying to be John Jackson this morning. I just forgot to put on my lip gloss, so my lips are a little unfilled. Um, can we please remind my shirt? I'm not bossy, I'm the boss, and that is what's up. I forgot to show you guys the final product of our cute crafting time Cooper's at school and we were way too tired last night. Um, so cute, Han oh, hold on, let me flip the camera. Okay, is that so cute? Hands down, you are awesome. And then we just bought a cute little soap, isn't that darling? Super easy, very inexpensive. Um, here's how the flowers turned out. Look at how cute with the little letters in the vase. Um, I was, if I took more time, I was gonna flip these all so the magnets would go out, but for the most part on that side, they're all, they're all in, but cute, huh? And then just some flowers in there. Cooper really loved that. Um, one thing I would recommend if you're gonna do these, don't get them with the print on the outside because you can't even see the Sharpies on the inside. I have Sharpies and chocolate, but the card, this is what the card says. It says, thank you for sharpening my mind this year, Cooper. Isn't that so cute? So, so cute. And then Cooper also got his teacher a little bracelet. He thought that was very special. He got her this necklace too, but it was broken, so I'll have to take that back. Anyways, cute ideas, really easy crafting ideas if you guys are looking for something. I don't know if it's too late if a lot of your school is ending, but our school is ending today, which is kind of exciting because we have never had school end before Memorial Day weekend. So we're really excited for school to be out and summer to happen. Cooper and I, 
I want to take him on all the adventures. I want to go fishing and camping and hiking and do all those fun things. So what are you guys doing for the summer? What are some of your fu summer fun summer plans or vacation ideas? Leave it down in the comments below. We would love to hear what you guys are planning on doing. Um, for your summer activities, do any of you go to summer camp or away for, um, you know, like a summer recreation is what we called it, but I don't know what you guys call it. Let us know. Cooper decided for his summer plans, he's gonna pout. Are you, gonna, are you pouting for the summer plans? <laughs> We're eating fries and Cooper said he doesn't like them. Why not? I think they're delicious. They're like, they're tiny. There's stuff on them. Yeah, they're herb, garlic herb fries. They're so good, you guys. We're just being so healthy today, huh? Okay, so tell mom, what are our big summer plans? Swimming. Swimming. Fishing. Oh, heck yeah, give me a high five for fishing. What about this? Are we gonna do any of this? What are we doing for the summer? Give me some. Uh, Koopa. What? Please, please finish telling me. A phone call interrupted our dinosaur session. This one. Please tell us, what are you guys doing for the summer? Is my English accent terrible? Oh, you said swimming, fishing, what else? Right, bye. Eating french fries. Writing right. Are you so ready just to stay up all night? Yes. What did you do last night to kick off your your summer activities? Sleepover. Sleepover with Gavin and Gage. Yes. Here it is, the first night of summer, and I tell the boys, "Oh, let's order pizza, let's watch movies. You guys can stay up late." And I look over at the couches at 11 o'clock. Gage, Gavin, and Cooper are all passed out sleeping. So. Way to kick off the summer night, but I guess it's a good thing they're on that summer schedule. Happy summer. We love you guys. We'd love to know what you're doing. What are your plans for the summer? What are you guys up to? Um, Cooper and I are going vintage shopping today, and we're looking to buy some new furniture, maybe some cool antiques for Cooper's room. What do you want to buy, Cooper? <laughs> Happy summer. <laughs> goodness I just want to speak like I'm from London all the time Cooper and I are going where we're we going darling darling where we're we going <laughs> he super thrilled about that four six eight I appreciate my mom she's great don't hopscotch with a sucker you're gonna kill yourself you guys I feel like I have a lot of good one-liners okay my turn get mom get the mom now you're supposed to do one foot two foot one foot Two, one, 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 two. <laughs> Sorry, you can't have a, you failed at your career in hopscotch. Okay, let's go antique shopping, come on. Had some lunch, and now where'd you go? Where'd you go? We're gonna go antique shopping. Um, you guys, look at how cute this old car is right here. Something I haven't done more of, and Pope Till actually has a lot of good antique shops, so hopefully we'll find some cool stuff. So, I wanna play a little game with you guys. Would you rather? Would you rather have Carl Butler man eyebrows? Or would you rather get them waxed and break out like a teenager? <sighs> because I'm pretty sure that's what's happening to me. I finally went and got my eyebrows waxed because I want them to be on fleek, as the cool kids say. And then I freaking break out and it takes me off the fleek that I just got on and it's really frustrating. So I'm just, yeah, oh, oh you see that? I don't even have to point it. I've had chicken pox. Why is this happening to me? Oh my gosh. I'm ugly. I mean, is this even real? Am I allergic to the wax? Like, look, I just got See. them waxed. <laughs> you have chicken pox. Those, son, are what you call zits. And that's what's going to happen to you when you hit puberty. Chicken pox. And you get armpits chicken in your pox. hair. Chicken pox. Chicken. Ow, I just poked myself in the eye. Probably because I was saying something pox. inappropriate. Chicken pox. <laughs> I'm crying because I'm breaking out so bad. I you just are. look old and like. <laughs> now I look like a monkey. 